Alright folks, this is Tom from anti-proton.com and I'm sitting here in a hotel somewhere on a business trip and this is a granite countertop. And I thought you might get a kick out of this granite countertop because most granite countertops are slightly radioactive. This one is no exception. The Polymaster here is registering 7.17 microsievert per hour. Oops. Plus or minus. And, oops, get back to that. And I'm looking at about 0.05 to 0.07 as a normal background for this area, so not too high. And of course, the Polymaster is actually energy sensitive, so we can do this. And we're taking a gamma spectrum right this moment. And as you can see, there's the gamma spectrum. Let's, uh, let's see if we can pick anything out of this gamma spectrum. I'm pretty sure we can take a good look at this and figure out what we're seeing. All right, let's kind of prop this up. We'll prop it up on the Polymaster. All right, well, this gamma spectrum is clearly thorium. Let's zoom in and see what we have here. Uh, thorium-232 and the 212 are right here. The energy on that is about 86, 87, somewhere in there KeV. There's a little bit of a peak here around 78, 79. And remember, thorium-232 is at 63.81. Lead-212 is at 77.11. Or at least those are two common peaks. What's next? Uh, let's see, we got a little something, looks like a peak going on at 169. And that's probably thorium-228 at 166. Uh, let's see, it should be something around 215. And there is right there, see? Just let me kind of zoom in. That's the first peak, that's the second peak, that's the third peak, those are all for th uh, thorium-228. I'll zoom down again. Oops. And let's see what else we have. How about a, how about a lead 212 at 238? Where is that? 238. There it is, right there. Zoom over and look at it. At 238 right there. There's a bit of a peak going on. See? Eh, plus or minus a little bit. It's about right. And that is for lead 212. Actinium 228 can be seen. That's this guy right here, that little bump. And actinium 228 is at 338. KEV, this is at 334, it's pretty close. The uh, thallium 208 should be at 538. Let's see what's at 538. 528. 5. Oops. Get over there. 5. 35, th right in the dot. 5, 540-ish. It's basically right, right. That's thallium 208. And we have two interesting ones. Actinium 228 is here. That would be right there. And there's another act actinium 228 right there. So the two of them are actually together. And potassium is right there. Yeah, plus or minus. Potassium is basically right there. To the potassium. Potassium. Close, close enough. It's about right. So this table, as beautiful it is, has thorium and potassium in it at about twice the normal background rate. Interesting. Well, this has been Tom from anti-proton.com, and we will see what else we can randomly find that's radioactive.